Hello friends, today we are going to discuss some more important question on a mathematical induction. Okay. So, in this video, video we are going to discuss two question uh, on induction and all both these questions uh, come in a university paper. Okay. So, this is a very important part. So, the question is that mathematical induction by using in mathematical induction we have to prove that that 7 plus 7 7 plus 7 7 7 plus up to 7 7 7 dot 7 equal to 7 upon 81 into 10 to the power n plus 1 minus n minus 10. Okay. So, as you already know there are three steps for induction. So, the step 1 say step 1 is basis of induction basis of induction. In this step, we are going to put n is equal to 1. Okay. So, as we see that uh, in the left hand side, okay, in the left hand side there is no n part means the series ends with 7. So, the left hand side remains 7 here and in the right hand side we put n equals to 1. So, it will become 7 by 81 10 to the power 1 plus 1 minus 9 into 1 minus 10. So, when we solve it, it becomes 7 by 81 10 square minus 9 minus 10. This will become 7 upon 81 100 minus 19. Okay. So, it comes out to be 7. This means that the left hand side is equal to the right hand side. So, this proves that when n equals to 1, so the equation remains the true. Now, in the step 2, step 2 is induction hypothesis, induction hypothesis. In this, we assume that we assume that by putting n equals to k in the equation, the statement is going to be true. Okay. So, the statement becomes 7 plus 7 7 plus 7 7 7 plus dot 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 7 7 dot dot 7 is equal to 7 by 81 10 to the power on where the n is, we put k. So, 10 to the power, 10 to the power k plus 1 minus 9 k minus 10 is true. So, the, in the step 2, we assume that, that this statement is true when n equals to k. Okay. Now, the step 3 is induction step, induction step. In this induction step, we put n equals to k plus 1 and we prove that, that by putting, while putting n equal to k plus 1 in the equation and with the help of the step 2, this statement, the third step is also remains true. So, how it is, well, how it works? So, first we put n equal to k plus 1. So, this will become 7 plus 7 7 plus 7 7 7 up to 7 7 dot dot 7 is equal to 7 by 81 10 to the power in uh, k plus 1 we put k plus 1 plus 1 minus 9 k plus 1 minus 10. Okay. This is the equation when we put n equal to k plus 1. Okay. Now, as we know that as we see that, that on the left hand side, this series, okay, this series will be continue and ends with, always ends with 7. So, can we write it as 7 plus 7 7 plus 7 7 7 plus dot 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 plus 7 7 7 up to so, up to 7 plus again this will repeat. So, this will become 7 7 7 is equal to 7 by 81. 10 to the power k plus 2 minus 9k minus 10. Okay. Now, uh, in the step 2, this whole part from here to here, 
this whole part is equal to 7 to the power 81 sorry 7 by 81 10 to the power k plus 1 minus 9 k minus 10. So, we substitute this value from the step 2 in the step 3. So, this will become now the equation becomes 7 uh, from instead of writing this we substitute this. So, this will become 7 by 81 10 to the power k plus 1 minus 9k minus 10 and remaining will be 777 dot 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 7 which is equal to the right hand side will become 7 to the power 7 by 81 10 to the power k plus 2 minus 9k plus 1 minus 10. Now, we have to solve the left hand side and prove that, that it is equal to the right hand side. How it will work? See here. First of all, uh, I am only taking the left hand side part. So, 7 to the power 80, uh, 7 by 81, 10 to the power k plus 1 minus 9k minus 10, it will remain same. Now, from this series, I am taking 7 as common and this will become 1, 1, 1 dot 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 1 here. Okay. Now, after that, I am keeping this as it is. Now, can I multiply or divide this part by 9? Okay. So, this will become 7 by 9, 9, 9, 9, dot, 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 9 here. Okay. The equation remains the same. Now, we have to break or we have to substitute this whole series in terms of 10 to the power something means if we have 10 to the power k minus 1. So, by after putting k equals to 0, so this will become 10 to the power 1 uh, if I, I mean if I write it as 10 to the power k plus 1 minus 1. On putting k equals to 0, it will become 10 minus 1, it will becomes 9. So, in the same way, can I write it as this series in terms of 10 to the power something as First, this will remain same minus 9k minus 10 plus 7 by 9 and can it can I write it as 10 to the power k plus 1 minus 1 because 10 to the power k plus 1 minus 1 on putting the value of different values k we can get this series. Okay. Now, uh, I am taking the LCM here so it will become 7 the remaining part will remain same. 9k minus 10, here we have 9 dot 7 dot 9, 10 to the power k plus 1 minus 1. Okay. Now, after solving further, 7 to the uh, 7 by 81, 10 to the power k plus 1 minus 9k minus 10 plus 7 by 81, we take it out as common here. So, the remaining part is n sorry 9 dot 10 to the power k plus 1 minus 9. Okay. So, this will become 7 to the power k 81 10 to the power k plus 2 okay, minus 9 k plus 1 minus 10 which is equal to which is equal to right hand side. So, therefore, left hand side is equal to right hand side hence proved we prove this equation, the main equation means this equation with the help of the mathematical induction. So, this is a very important question okay, in terms of university exam or your semester or your minor test exam. Okay. Now, we are going to discuss the next question uh, in the same manner. The question is show that 3 plus 3 3 plus 3 3 3 plus 3 3 up to 3 is equal to 10 to the power n plus 1 minus 9 minus 10 upon whole upon 27. So, we may uh, do this question in the same pattern. Okay. So, first step is step 1. First step is basis of induction. In this we put n equals to 1. Okay. So, in the left hand side the n term is 3 and in the right hand side we substitute n equal to 1. So, it will become 
10 to the power 2 minus 9 minus 10 whole upon 27. So, this will become 100 minus 19 upon 27 or 81 by 27 or 3. Okay. So, therefore, the left hand side is equal to the right hand side value. So, this is the step 1. Okay. Clear? Now, the step 2 is induction hypothesis. So, in this step, we are assuming that when n equals to k, the statement will be true. So, we, we assume it. This is the assumption. So, the equation will become 3 plus 3 3 plus 3 3 3 plus dot 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 plus 3 3 up to 3 is equal to on substituting the n equals to k. So, this will become k plus 1 minus 9k minus 10 whole upon 27 is true, is true. So, we assume it. Now, in the step 3, in the step 3 which is a uh, induction step, we put n equal to k plus 1 and with the help of the, with the help of the step 2, we are going to prove that the left hand side is equals to right hand side. So, first we put n equal to k plus 1. So, the equation will become 3 plus 3 3 plus 3 3 3 up to 3 3 up to 3 which is equals to 10 to the power k plus 2 minus 9 k plus 1 minus 10 whole upon 27. Okay. Now, with the help of step 2, we substitute the value. First, we have this series will be repeated on. So, we can write it as 3 plus 3 plus 3 3, 3 3 up to 3 3 and 3. Again, we can repeat this. So, this will become 10 to the power k plus 2 minus 9 k, okay, uh, 9 k plus 1 minus 10 upon 27. So, I am going to solve a step 2 or uh, going to solve the right and left hand side and prove that, that it is equal to the right hand side value. So, I can substitute, I can substitute this value in place of this. So, this will become uh, 10 to the power k plus 1 minus 9k minus 10 whole upon 27 plus 3 3 up to 3. So, this is the left hand side, remaining left hand side. Now, in the same manner, 10 to the power k plus 1 minus 9k minus 10 whole upon 27. We take 3 common here, 1 1 dot 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 1. After that, minus 9k minus 10 whole upon 27 plus uh, we multiply or divide by 9. Okay. So, this will become uh, 3 3 or we can say 9 upon 9 or it will become 9 9 dot dot 9. Okay. So, we multiply or divide by 9 here. Now, can I write it as this as minus 9k minus 10 whole upon 27 plus, okay, plus, sorry. Uh, here we were for, for getting the value 9 here, we have already 3 here. So, we uh, multiply and divide by 3 this whole, whole equation. So, this will become 999 9, 9 upon 3. So, this here we have 10 to the power k plus 1 minus 1 whole upon 3. Okay. Here we multiply and divide by 3. So, this will become we have already 3 here. So, 3 into 3 that is 999 9, 9 upon 3. Now, for 999 up to 9, we can write it as n to the power k plus 1 minus 1. Now, we after solving this, we take 27 here. This will remain as it is. And here, 3 9 is a 27. So, this will become 9 dot 9 dot 10 to the power k plus 1 minus 9. So, after solving this, we get 10 to the power k plus 2 minus 9 k plus 1 minus 10 whole upon 27 which is equals to right hand side. So, this is how 
this will become therefore left hand side is equal to right hand side hence rho so this is how we solve these type of question of mathematical induction first we discuss this question that is 7 plus 7 7 up to this series this type of series and the second part is this so there are three step basis of induction in which we put n equal to 1 then we have induction hypothesis in which we assume n equal to k which is true and with the help of this step 2 we uh, the step 3 is induction step in which we put n equal to k plus 1 so i hope you understood this and if you have any query then you can ask in our comment section or you can send your query to our business email id that is itechnicallearning at the So keep watching our video. Thank you so much.